Hey guys, how are we doing? Look at these. These look so delicioso. Um, Michael went grocery shopping a little bit ago, and I seen these. Like, I he's so sweet. He's always so thoughtful. I showed him these at the grocery store uh, a few weeks ago, and I'm like, ooh, I'd like to try those so he came home and he picked them up and he fixed them all up and baked them <laughs> but these are it says new ready to bake in five minutes how long did you do these for like 10 minutes 12 minutes 10 12 minutes he just said but these are the pillsbury filled crescents cherry they are you get eight and they are fill and bake crescents but they come with two pouches. One is the cherry filling that you fill. And then the other is the icing pouch. So I'm going to put icing on half of them. And then the other half I'm going to leave icing off of these. Because I don't do icing. <laughs> Michael does. But yeah. So and it says... There are 140 calories for, I'm assuming for one. Yeah, for one. My gosh, there's a lot of sodium. 240 grams of sodium. But yeah, these look so good. Actually, let's, let's do a little taste do, shall we? Um, okay, actually, I'll be right back. Okay, so I think you'll be able to see, maybe you won't be able to see my head, but my husband's working on the other side, so, but I'm going to scoop these up. Well, actually, wait, I'm going to put the icing on first, so I'll put icing on four of them for my hubby bubby. Ooh, pretty, pretty. When I worked at Arby's, we, I used to bake the... I used to have to put turnovers in the oven and <laughs> put in the icing on. This reminds me of the icing I used to have to drizzle on the top when I would pull them out of the oven. I just, there's certain icings I can do and certain icings I can't. They're too sweet. I'll put a little bit more on for my honey. And I'll show you how pretty, guys. Ooh. Looks so fancy. I'll have to show you guys what, and my husband likes when I've done these where, uh, remember, honey, the crescent rolls and I would put ham and cheese in it? Those are great. Oh, thank you. You guys hear that? <laughs> I'll have to do that. But you get a packet of crescent rolls, and um, I would take some lunch meat, ham lunch meat, and then I would take some cheese. I would get the baby bell cheese, cut, pe cut them into pieces, and... Stuff them inside the crescent rolls, roll up the crescent rolls, pop them in the oven for however long, like the 10 to 13 minutes. And when they would come out, I would have a butter mixture, a clarified butter with uh, garlic and parsley. And I would dust the top of the crescent rolls. And oh my gosh, they were so good. You just heard him. <laughs> so... But, yeah, I'll have to do that. The reason why I'm talking about it, because those are crescent rolls, too. So, but, yeah. Ugh. You want one of these now? No. They look so pretty. I'm almost tempted to put icing on one of them, but, for me, but, I don't know. No, I'm just going to leave it off. Oh. These would be great with ice cream. Like, even when I worked at uh, Arby's, uh, I think I told my husband this. I would take the, because of the shake machine, the shake part, it comes out just like ice cream. 
So on my break, when I would give myself a little meal, I make these crazy sandwiches, but I would take a turnover and uh, pour a little bit of ice cream next to it, and oh, it was so good. All right, you guys, so this is, I hope you can see, but... There's the icing ones I just did, and let me try one. Mmm. Oh my god. Mmm. It's like cherry pie filling. Mmm. Ooh. <laughs> oh my gosh, these are so good. Very, very good. Mmm. Okay, guys, I just wanted to do. A quick check-in and share these with you and do a little taste test and yeah go get these these are fantabulous so until next time see you later alligators